In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can use the contact tool on Javi with Instagram to direct message people and therefore improve your followings even more. What is going on guys? The Cash Creator is back with another video and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about how you can use the contact tool with Javi and you can use this to direct message people anywhere on Instagram and it will therefore improve your followers, improve your engagement and simply improve the amount of people that are looking at your profile, viewing your stories, viewing your posts, liking your posts, it will improve everything, okay? So before I do that, um, before I show you guys how to use it, I'm going to explain to you why it's so important, okay? So think of it like this. Obviously, you want a lot of followers on your Instagram accounts, okay? That's the name of the game. Get loads of followers and then you can start making money off them, okay? So first things first, why is DMing people so important, okay? So I'm going to be showing you guys an example with my pets page, okay? I post cute pictures and videos of pets, dogs, cats, all types of pets, okay? So how do I use the DM tool? The way I use it is I find popular pets pages, you know, similar pages to mine but really popular with loads of followers and I extract those followers and then I DM them. I tell them, hey guys, I think you'd be really interested in my profile. Please check it out. They're going to see my followers, you know, they're going to see my, you know, content and then they're going to follow me. Simple as that because they, I already know that they like that content because they're already following a similar account. So if I DM those people and I say to them, hey guys, check out my account, the odds are that they'll follow me too. It's that simple, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to use that tool, all right? So first things first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the tools section over here, um, and then when I do that, I'm going to click on the account, okay? So I'm going to go on the settings, for this pets page over here tools and then the settings all right and then what you do is you click over here onto the contact section okay so as you can see here we are on the contact section of Javi okay so first things first what we want to do like I said is to extract the users all right so if you go over here and just read this you can see that here are the settings all right so if you want to extract the followers of a popular page for example all you want to do is type followers slash the name of the page all right um, or if you want to extract the people that that page is following you click followings and then slash the name of the page or you know commenters people who are commenting on that page and so on so forth um, like I said I'm going to be using the popular pets page as an example so I've looked at a popular pets page which has over 100k followers which is similar to mine and I'm going to be DMing direct messaging and contacting the followers of that page alright so what you need to do is simply type followers and then slash and then the name of the page so the name of the page is called pets today pets dot today alright um, and then you scroll down here uh, if you don't want, you know, people that don't speak English, you can check that, okay, um, and then you can say they have a minimum number of posts, so then you don't get any robots, alright, um, yeah, and you can play around with these settings if you want, you can even have males or females, alright, um, and then all you have to do is you have to click extract users, and if you scroll down to the bottom over here, it says pending, I've extracted 60 people, um, and it's 60 because I chose 60 I can increase it or decrease it if I want to alright guys um, and then you just have to wait for it to you know show extracted and then this this status will show as finished you just have to be patient because Javi is looking for these people um, that you're gonna contact and then it's gonna add them to your um, messaging list okay so you just have to be patient and wait for these people to be extracted um, that's really important OK, um, and then when they have been extracted, they're going to be showing up over here in the use extracted users section. All right. They'll show up over here, all 60 of those people. And then what you can do is you can message them. So whilst I wait for those people to be extracted, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use spin tax or spin syntax, as it's called. So this is basically a way that you guys can 
randomize the message that you are sending. This is really important for you because if you don't randomize the messages, Instagram may block you, for example. All right. Um, and for a lot of people that don't understand programming, I'm going to be showing you a really easy way to do it. OK, so what you want to do is you want to go on the Internet and then go on this link over here. Easy article link dot com slash article spinner slash free dot PHP. I'm going to leave a link in the description to show you guys, um, but I'm going to do it for you real quick. All right. So all you have to do is you know, when you have this page open, you just have to type the message that you want to type. And then you have to click on launch assisted spin editor um, and then you can, you know, change the words around. So it's randomized. I'll show you that real quick. All right. So here's the message that message that I'm going to send. Um, hey, guys. Hey, hey, um, I like your page. <coughs> um, um, I think you would be interested in my content so I decided to message you so that you can check it out have a good day okay so that's a nice polite message um, and then you know the person who sees this will see, hey, yeah, why don't I check out his page? And, you know, they might give you a follow because you already know that they like, you know, cute pets pictures because they're already following um, a similar account. So they're going to, you know, look at your message, check out your page and then hopefully give you a follow. All right. So what you want to do is you want to click launch, spin, launch assisted spin editor um, and then simply, um, you know, for the word that's highlighted here, it says, hey, you want to click over here on any suggestions that are similar okay to randomize it so hello or hi or what's up um or you know yeah um and then what you want to do is when you're ready for the next word you click on this next spin um i like or you could click on you know similar words i love um yeah next next spin um your you know there's no really words that I'd have that are similar to that. Next spin page, you know, you can change for profile, profile page. Um, yeah. And then next spin, I think similar words to that is I believe, I do believe, I do think, I feel it is my opinion. Nah, in my view. Okay. Next spin is you would, you will be interested you are likely to be interested you could possibly you would probably okay so these are all words you know so when i post this thing this spin text into Java, it will choose a word at random so you know instagram will not suspect you of being a robot because it's all random messages and not the exact same message every single time okay so next um be interested in um, uh, my content so instead of content i could have information material um yep next spin so thus therefore okay i decided to make a decision to decided i would next message um, contact okay take a look all right so there you are That is how you use spin tax. Um, it was quite, quite short, but I'm gonna, you know, this, this tutorial is really about how to use the contact tool. Okay. So that's that. Um, what you want to do next is you want to simply close the spinner, copy this material. Um, and then as you can see, the users have been extracted. They're all extracted over here. As you can see, if you scroll to the bottom, it says 60 extracted. You go back to use extracted users. They're all over here. OK, that's all the users that like cute pets pages. OK, and then you scroll down and then you simply paste your text into here. That spin text that you created. OK, um, and if you click on check spin syntax, as you can see, here is a random result. Hey, I like your page. I do believe you will be interested in my material. So I made a decision to contact you so that you could check it out. OK, um, and then if you click it on again, it will look a bit different. So hi, I love your profile. Click on it again. 
Hi, I like your profile. Hi, hey, I love your profile. See, it's all slightly different. So as you can see, Instagram will not detect you of using a robot because you're using a lot of random different messages instead of the same one. Okay, so that's how you use spin syntax. And now I'm going to carry on with our video on showing you how you can use this to DM people. So what you want to do next is you want to add to send messages list. Okay, you want to add these people to the send messages list. So you start sending messages to all these extracted users. All right. Um, so you simply click over here to add to send messages. Uh, actually, before you do that, you have to select them all. So you select all these people over here and then you click on add to send messages list. As you can see, 60 messages were sent. Okay, and then you go on send messages over here and you this is the setting so I'm going to show you that in you know a minute or two but I've, as you can see if you scroll down over here here are all the messages all right okay so look as you can see these are all the people that like cute pet pages and here are your messages they're all slightly different so Instagram will not suspect you of using a robot all right um, and then what you want to do is you want to change these settings okay so you want to be messaging around a lot, you know, not too many people a day because Instagram will suspect you. So I'd say, you know, around 10 people a day is optimum. OK, so you can do that by increasing the time between messages. So change it to, you know, 200, for example, and it's nine messages. Um, you, you know, you can decrease the delay to, you know, um, 1800, for example, and then it increases. OK, so you can play around with these settings as you want and then get the required amount of messages you want to send per day or per hour okay and it shows over here it changes every time you change a setting okay um, and then you can change the execution time between 12 a.m and 11 50 a.m p.m you can change however you want all right um okay and then that's pretty much it it's really that simple um you know these messages will get sent over time um, all you have to do next is you have to press this to make it started and then these messages will slowly get sent out you know 10 messages every single day so that is how you use the contact tool I hope you guys enjoyed this video please do not forget to leave a like leave a comment and a subscription if you enjoyed this video this is the cash creator signing out peace out guys